on 2-9 crew hey guys guess where i'm at yup i'm in philadelphia baby Woo! and you know when i'm in philly you know what i'm gonna be getting especially now that i'm home and everything you know what i'm getting you know what i'm getting right now oh yeah yeah that's right i am getting me some cheesesteaks i'm gonna show y'all my five top cheesesteaks in philadelphia and i don't mean just in one section of philly i mean around the city that i usually go to whenever i was doing my run around the city these are the spots that i always hit up because their cheesesteaks are mm, you know but i'm not doing this alone and everything today i'm joined by my family say hi guys hi yeah What's right. up, 2 9 crew? Hey, yeah. 2 9 crew. Yeah, so I got my brother. His name is Dwayne. What's up? My sister-in-law. Her name is Michelle. Hello. And then these two crazy boys right back here. <laughs> Xavion and Carlos. Man, oh God, they crazy. But we are right here right now in Philadelphia, and we're going to be checking out these spots that I'm going to be taking them to. I needed this help because, man, trying to eat five cheesesteaks, that's a lot. You know, that's a lot. So I'm not going to be eating it by myself. So but we're going to get on in and we're going to check out these uh, first spots and everything. But before we do that, you know what we need to do, right? Come on, guys. You know what we need to do. Darn right. We need to pray over this food. So join in with me, guys. Lord Jesus, thank you for this food that we are about to what? Devour. Exactly. <laughs> In your name, Jesus, I pray. Amen. Amen. Now, I'm over here at Tony and Nick's. It used to be Tony Luke's, but since they are not there anymore, Tony Luke's, since they changed the name of it, I don't think they, uh, I don't think it's going to be the same and everything. They would have been on the list, but they're not there, though. So, deuces. So the first joint we're hitting up is John Roast Pork in South Philadelphia. Oh boy. And you know these guys are James Beard Award winner. Yes, so these things be hitting. So now we're gonna open this bad boy up now, okay? Oh, uh, look at that bad boy right there. Don't that look good? Woo wee! Oh man, I can't wait to get this down in my belly! Yeah! So yeah guys, as you see, this is how it is, and we're splitting it up. Yeah, it's five of us, so of course, you know, we gotta split this bad boy up. <laughs> but, as you see that, see that right there? Oh yeah, look at that! Yeah, baby. Everybody got their own piece and everything, so... Alright. So alright. All together. Let's get this down. <laughs> mm. Mm. <laughs> oh yeah. It's okay. <laughs> Why <Fine, but all. laughs> <laughs> I just had to throw something in there. It is a pretty good cheese thing. <laughs> <laughs> videos come on you know <laughs> I'm, I'm so happy to be home so <laughs> this is like a poppy seed bread or something like yeah. that yeah this is pretty good mm -hmm. you taste that seasoning on but it boy oh boy mm. yeah. and I'm, let, let me say too i'm glad to be finally in the video with my little brother <laughs> yes <laughs> well guys how do you like that steak it was, it was delicious. delicious. All right, but we still got some more to try, though, okay, guys? So, right. hey. I think let's... I got the belly for it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we got more to try, so we're going to be uh, heading up to the next spot, okay? So stay tuned, all right? All right. Next up is Angelo's Pizzeria, another South Philly establishment. And boy, is it good. But man, the lines to this place it is so long. You just be waiting for ever for your cheesesteak now. It was never like this before when I was getting my cheesesteaks a while back. Listen for your name. I 
can tell you they was never like this before. Ever. You can just easily come up in here and get one, but since the vloggers started coming up in here, oof, hey, this place crazy famous. Finally got it, guys. Finally got it. I know, it took a while. Now let's open this bad boy up. All right, so check this out. Ooh. Oh, yeah, guys. Ain't that, ain't ain't that looking look so good, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, buddy. That looks so, so fine. All right, guys, there it go. Nice sarcone bread. Oh yeah, that sarcone bread, man. Yeah, I'll tell you. All right, guys. Ready up, ready yeah, up. Yeah. Bottoms up, baby, bottoms up. <laughs> First place was good, but this is delicious. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I told him guys. Even though this is only the second spot that we hit, but yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's it's close. That's the reason why. <laughs> oh yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm talking about. Glad to be back in Philly right now. <laughs> That bread, the sarcone bread, is absolutely fire, you know? The only issue I have is they don't chop their meat up good. Oh, I like my meat like that. You like the whole like that? Yeah. Yeah, too finely chopped? Yeah. I mean, it, it just tastes like you're eating hamburger, you know? So. Oh, okay. That's right. Well, everybody like what they like. Yeah. That is true. Though. Everybody like what they like, though. But how's that bread though for y'all? How that I bread? I like it. Yes. I like it. <laughs> Sarcone yeah. bread, man. Sarcone bread does it. Is it like toasted? No. Oh. That's how the bread comes. Mm. Good. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I it too. <laughs> so guys, as you see, guys, I knew they was gonna love this one. I shouldn't have bought them here first though, you know. But <laughs> it's fine by me though. We're gonna go and hit the next one. All right. So here we go. Our next stop is in Kensington section of Philadelphia at One Pound Cheese Steak. Oh yeah, these guys, these guys used to hit, especially when you're so hungry and you need a lot of food and they got a lot of rich history as well. So now we're checking this one out right here, okay? Oh yeah. Well, as you see guys, I mean, yeah, it's not as impressive as the other one and everything, but I'll tell you though, this was still one of my spots though to go to though, you know? Still one of my spots to hit up. But I still can't wait to get this down my belly though, man. I still can't wait to get this down my belly. As you see guys, here it go right here. Oh yeah. And also too, this bun is so soft. All right guys, let's get this down. Mm. Mm. I like the taste. They still hit the spot with the taste, you know? Mm -hmm. And the bread, mm-hmm. Oh yeah, the bread is nice. And nice soft. and soft oh, yeah. and chewy. And this is a different type of bread from the last two spots. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Mm-mm. Uh, yeah, I can appreciate that difference. <laughs> and, the, and it's nice and soft. Oh, mm -hmm. oh yeah. Tastes so good, make you want to slap yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Man. Don't you mean your nephew? <laughs> <laughs> Now, what do you say about that, Carlos? You say the other one was good. This one is good, but it won't be some of the other one. <laughs> <laughs> the second one? Second. The second one, yeah. Yeah. I mean, hands down, the second one was definitely cheesy. Mm -hmm. But this, for me, it, 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 it's, it's, it's more flavorful. I, I think so. That's just my opinion. Everybody has their own, so. So if you want to try it, you need to come to One Pound Cheese State. In Philly. In Philly. Get your own. Yeah, Kensington, guys. In Kensington. Yeah, the Kensington section. If y'all afraid of Kensington section, then don't come. But, you know. <laughs> You're pretty safe in the daytime, I believe. I believe so. Yeah, 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 yeah. Probably some guy. <laughs> I'm lost the words right now. But now it's time to get up out of here. Next up, we're headed up to the Hunting Park section of Philadelphia to go to Max's Steaks. Oh yeah, Max's Steaks. 
man, when that, whenever you're in this neighborhood and you want yourself a cheesesteak, gotta come here because you see how these ladies are working so hard. They're working so hard. And then you could go to the bar and chill at the bar. And also they're using the corporate bread. Oh my God, corporate bread is so good. So now that I got this cheesesteak from Max's. Let's get this down, okay? Let's check this out. <laughs> I mean, it does look good. Like how it always been, you know what I mean? Shoot, they hooked this bad boy up, you know? Style, exactly, you know. This is looking like what I know a cheese thing to look like, right? See if it tastes that way. There we go, guys. Oh yeah, look at that. Look oh, at that trippy yeah. trip, trip, trip. Looks All right. Good. Yeah. yeah. Shell, she can't eat no more, but that's fine. You know what I mean? Because that means more for me. <laughs> All right, guys. Right. Out, guys. I'm full. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's get this down. Let's get this down. Mm. I tell you, man, the bread, the bread, the bread, the bread means everything, and this bread is bomb. <laughs> mm. So chewy, so chewy. Thank you, brother, for allowing us to be a part of this vlog today. I've been wanting to get on this vlog for quite some time. Appreciate you. Love you, brother. You don't want to taste any of the meat? This one's more finely chopped. That taste is good. Mm-hmm. 100% sirloin, you know? 100% sirloin. So now, guys, it's time on for the next one, okay? So let's get there. Now. Yeah. So this is where I'm at now, guys. And unfortunately, Delisandro's is closed. Oh man, I tell you. Yeah, I tell you that was gonna be my last spot, but since they're closed, and since we're all full anyway, this is going from a top five to a top four. Okay? Yeah, unfortunately, we, we're just gonna <laughs> we're just gonna basically say, yeah, this yeah, that's it, that's it, guys. But as you know, we gotta rate these guys, so here we Yeah. Ah, so back in the car and we're done for the night and everything and we all got water ice right here yeah <laughs> oh yeah you see mine's right here Woo! oh man i can't wait to get this down to my oh, belly yeah. and everything nah it's not going to happen guys come on i got five more months left until this year is up for me having nothing but water so i want to relinquish this i want to relinquish you. this yeah <sighs> yeah but all those cheesesteaks were fine. So good. So good. What y'all think, guys? Oh, yeah. Yes. Delicious. I'm so full. Good. Oh, yeah. Stick a fork in me. I'm good. Even though I couldn't <laughs> take the last one, they were still good. Yeah. So, of course, you know, this is going from five to four, top five to top four. Yeah. So, we're going to be doing our ratings and everything. So, for my number four. For my number four, you know, somebody's got to be at the bottom, of course, you know. But this is how I feel and everything. Number four for me would be one pound cheesesteak. Yeah. I mean, don't get it wrong. They were they were so good. So, I mean, so flavorful. The bread was nice and chewy. So nice and chewy and everything. But unfortunately for me, one guy be at the bottom and everything. How about you guys? What's yours? Yeah, I, I, one, one pound, pound cheese thing, I agree. One pound? One pound? Yeah, one pound? yeah. yeah we're all in the cahoots with the uh, number four and everything now. Number three. Number three. I am going to let you know. Number three for me is... This is a tough one. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's so hard right now. Because number three... I mean, because that, that's the solid number right there because you're still at the bottom, but you're not at the top, you know? Right. So, yeah. <sighs> oh, man. I, I can't, I'm at a loss for words right now. <laughs> no, guys, I really wasn't at a loss for words. I was really stumped on what I was thinking about. I am telling you guys, COVID brain is so real. It is absolutely the realest that you could ever get. I mean, I totally forgot what I was thinking of at this point right here. But back to what the real result is, though, okay? Jeez. Okay. All right, I got the decision now and everything. Even though they were fine, they were so good, my number three is Max's. 
yeah maxis i love you guys every time i was in north philly doing deliveries y'all was my spot to hit up and everything but of course you know there's always one that would be better you know but what do you guys think what's what's y'all number three what's your number three not mine's is number three mine's is number three is max's but y'all got y'all opinion what's y'all number three same. I didn't eat on that. Yeah, she didn't have Max's, so of course, think, you know. I think Max's was at the bottom of the barrel for me. So, that's number... That's number... That's number your number three, but my number four. So, we already said number four then. <laughs> but, yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay, all right. So, 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 all right, guys. It's the boy that I need. Brain free. No, no, I ain't that. <laughs> <laughs> so he's switching his number four now his number four is max's and his number three is one pound cheesesteak is that right is that right okay all right we got that right now now my number two of course my number two between number two and number one is always the hardest and of course you know once i reveal number two number one is going to be revealed as well too so my number two even though i love these guys too but you're number two for me, guys. Sorry, guys. And that is John Roast Pork. Ah, I know. Yeah, I know. I know. John Roast Pork. It'd be so hitting. So hitting all the time and everything. So that tell you right there, my number one is definitely Angelo's. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, guys, reveal y'all number two, guys. What's y'all number two? Angelo's. So, Angelo's your number two? Mm-hmm. All right, so your number no, wait, one is... Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. No, John Pork is my number two. John Rose Pork is his number two. Mine too. Yep, I agree. All right. And so everybody, we're all in agreement when it comes to number two and number one. We only have one disagreement when it comes to number three and number four. You know, but that's fine though. You know, but what what do y'all think about my top four though? Delicious. Yes, okay. awesome. All right. All right. I didn't make it to four. <laughs> it was delicious. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, but guys, I did, when I was uh, living over here, I did eat at a lot of cheesesteak spots. But what had been my number two is now number five because for some reason they were closed. I think they're getting a the renovation done or so, but it's fine. You know, right across the street from it was Chubby's, but I, I really, I didn't really didn't want to hit up Chubby's and everything because last time I hit up Chubby's they, they didn't do a really good job to my sandwich and stuff you know but they do have some good flavors but you know that's, that's not my spot though you know but any hoots though any hoots I can tell you though all those were hitting and now now it's time to hit the toilet <laughs> yeah the empty these things out it's time to hit the toilet and that's what we gonna be doing right now well me personally anyway you know <laughs> I, I gotta empty this out because i need to flush for some dinner see you yeah. mine. no dinner for me <laughs> i ate dinner <laughs> he ate lunch and dinner with this so guys though if y'all like this video please don't forget to hit that like button yes hit that like button okay and also too if you are not a subscriber please subscribe to the channel all right Subscribe to my channel, please. So, until next time, until next video, Lord willing, peace. Love you guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel.